Today's topic is hamstring injury. A hamstring injury is an injury that occurs when one of the hamstring muscles is strained or pulled. The hamstring muscles are a group of large, powerful muscles that run along the back of the thigh, crossing both the hip and the knee. There are three types of hamstring muscles, semitendinosus, semimembranosus, and biceps femoris. They start at the bottom of the pelvis and end near the top of the lower leg. The hamstring muscles are important as they function to both actively bend the knee and extend the hip joint, as in the motion of moving the thigh backward. The hamstring muscles are not used much while walking or standing, but they are very active during power activities that involve bending the knee, such as climbing, jumping, and running. During a hamstring injury, one or more of these muscles gets overloaded and might even start to tear. A hamstring injury can range from a minor strain, classified as grade 1, to a major rupture, classified as grade 3. Causes A hamstring injury is caused by physical activities that stretch the hamstring muscles beyond their limits. This may include rapid acceleration activities when running or initiating running activity. Hamstring injuries are relatively common in sports such as soccer, football, track and field events, baseball, and tennis. A hamstring injury can also occur more gradually or during slower movement that overstretches the hamstring. Symptoms Sudden pain at the time of injury along with a popping feeling. Pain and tenderness in the back of the thigh and lower buttock. It may be painful to move the leg or bend over. Bruising you should see a doctor if you can no longer bear any weight on the injured leg, or if you are unable to walk more than a few steps without significant pain. Diagnosis and Treatment To make a diagnosis, the doctor will check for swelling and tenderness along the back of the thigh. To help pinpoint injured muscles and check any ligament or tendon damage, the doctor might move your leg into a variety of positions. In severe cases, imaging tests such as x-rays, ultrasound, and MRI, can help visualize bone detachment and tears in your muscles and tendons. The intensity and location of your pain can help determine the extent and nature of the damage. Treatment The initial goal of any treatment plan is to reduce pain and swelling. To do this, the doctor may recommend taking a break from activities that are strenuous to allow the injury to heal. Applying ice packs, using cane or crutches, resting with your leg elevated, wrapping the injured area with a compression bandage. The doctor may also recommend wearing a compression short to minimize swelling. Taking over-the-counter pain medications, such as ibuprofen or acetaminophen, to reduce pain and inflammation. Physical therapy, where a doctor can show you how to perform specific exercises designed to improve flexibility and strengthen the hamstring muscles. Surgery. In cases where the muscle has detached from where it is connected to the pelvis or shin bone, an orthopedic surgery can reattach it. To help minimize your risk of having a hamstring injury, regular exercises and stretching can help with that. If your occupation is physically challenging, regular conditioning can help prevent injuries. Thank you for watching our video. Please do not forget to like and share the video. Also, please subscribe to the channel to stay updated on our latest videos.